Good morning. Today is July 2nd, 2023. Today I'm on a mission to Summit Granite Peak, somewhere back there, which is Montana's highest mountain, highest point in the state. Um, considered by many to be one of the most difficult state high points to reach. I'm going to try and do it in a day here. Um, it's currently just before 6 a.m. I'm two miles in. It's called Lady of the Lake right here. Very peaceful. Um, but it should be about a 28 mile round trip just about 5,000 feet of climbing. Um, not quite sure what the snow load is going to be like. So I've got my ice axe. Um, I've got my crampons. I've got my helmet. So I'm prepared. I've got lots of warm clothes in the back. So I'm definitely uh, going much heavier than usual here. But we'll see what the conditions are. So far it's been smooth sailing. Uh, it's very wet up here right now. Um, there's rivers running all through the trail and everything. Um, very muddy. Um, but so far I've managed to keep my feet mostly dry. So... We'll see how this goes. Um, so far, so good. Um, but once we get up above tree line, that's when the real fun begins. Well, I made it approximately three miles before I had to soak my feet. Could have been worse, I guess. They could have been soaked from the beginning. But something tells me this is uh, one of many streams to cross on this trip. Good thing it's going to be a beautiful day. Trail's a little wet right now. Kind of a swamp. But that view... That makes it all worth it right there. Oh yeah. I'm about four miles in, 9,000 feet elevation wise. And this is the point where I get to go on the less well-maintained trail. So it should be 10 more miles of this. Yay. And multiple stream crossings. I can't wait. Yay. Such a beautiful day. That was cold. Gorgeous area here. Definitely frost on the ground, so it froze last night. Now I just gotta cross this mess of stream braids here. So feet are definitely going to get wet and cold. So I'm gonna do this as quickly and as safely as possible. It's still cold out. This is Lone Elk Lake, just below 10,000 feet. And still pretty frozen up here. So I'm starting to get worried now as I get above 10,000 feet, what the snow is gonna be like. I can't quite distinguish which mountain back there is Granite Peak. It's one of those in the back left there. But slightly concerning seeing all this snow. 
that could either make my life really easy or really difficult. We're about to find out. I'm almost to the three hour mark. It's so making pretty good time, but that pace is gonna change one way or the other really soon. But I'm gonna take a little break here, um, get refueled, rehydrated, and uh, set out on the next trek, which I can almost guarantee there's no trail. So that'll be fun. Right in the middle there of the screen is Granite Peak. So there's definitely still snow on it. The question is how hard is the snow? So I've got crampons and ice axe, so it's not too bad. It might actually be easier than if there was no snow. But I'm gonna scramble up to the base there, check it out, see how it is, currently 10.30. I would like to be heading back from the summit no later than 1 p.m. So we'll have to see how slow going it is. It's kind of a big climb, 1,300 feet or something from the base to the top there. But yeah, it's still winter up here, even though it's July 2nd. Crazy how long these mountains hold snow. Pretty much made it to the base here. And I can see the route that I'm gonna take, and there's definitely footprints there. But it does look pretty steep. So I'm gonna have to get to the bottom of that snow tongue there on the right see just how steep that is it looks like that first part is the steepest and it gets less steep from there we kind of zigzag back and forth across the mountain but it's 11 a.m right now we need my lunch fuel up and uh get to the actual base and see how it looks Standing at the base here of Granite Peak, and it doesn't look too bad. That middle section looks like the worst, but I think I'm gonna give it a shot. So I'm gonna get my safety gear on, put my crampons on, put my helmet on, my axe out, and we're gonna we're gonna go for it. See how far I can get. <laughs> well, I'm getting there, I'm about a quarter of the way up. It's actually easier going than I thought. The snow is like perfect for stepping in. Someone has already stamped a trail up here. Ice axe coming in handy. Got the helmet and the crampons. Uh, so it's actually going way better than I expected. So I'm about a quarter of the way up. I'm almost to the part they call the ramp and then I'll shoot up the ramp to the summit. Probably less than a thousand more feet to go of climbing. Yay. I don't think the camera does this justice. Just how steep this climb is here. It is a workout, but making good progress almost to the turn of the ramp here. Right down there is where I ate lunch. So it's 12, no, it's 11.50 right now. It's looking good. Just taking a quick break right here. I've got 350 more feet of elevation gain to do. It's low going because this is so steep. It's crazy. I do almost think though that the snow here <clears throat> makes, it, makes it easier. We'll see if I change my mind going back down. But so far so good, 12.14 right now. I should be at the ridge the summit, hopefully around 1230. Spend a couple minutes up there, then head back down. Absolutely gorgeous day up here. Amazing. There's one gnarly peak here. Just keeps going. Very scrambly. I'm gonna take my time, but almost to the summit. So close. Woo. I made it to Granite Peak. Amazing. What a slog though, holy moly. The final ascent took me almost an hour and a half and it's gonna take at least that long going back down. Uh, Cause I'm not gonna be going any faster going down. But wow, awesome, awesome mountain. Definitely not for the faint of heart though. 
rather exposed on this last probably 300 feet of elevation gain. Um, a little bit squirrely up here, but I am the only one up here. Very rugged area here in the Bear Tooth mountain range, I think. Um, I saw one, I saw two tents on the way in. I'm just 14 miles from when I started this morning to the peak here. Two tents, I saw zero people. So pretty crazy, but absolutely gorgeous view up here. Gorgeous temperature, only a light breeze. It's absolutely amazing. I'm gonna sit up here, soak in the view, and then uh, begin the slog back down. That's gonna be fun. Well, the descent's going a lot quicker now that I realized I could go face forward. Getting down in no time. I like it. About halfway down right now. Almost to the bottom of the ramp. Then over to the snow tongue. Then I can go sail for a long ways. Looking forward to that.